so you're thinking about moving over to Austin, Texas, specifically the Mueller neighborhood. Well, perfect. My name is Blake Hamrock. I'm going to be breaking down the Mueller neighborhood and showing you guys three different homes and three different price ranges around the area. Currently, I'm in Mueller Park. It's honestly a beautiful day. It's end of October. It's 75 degrees out here. There's families walking along the trail. There is the Mueller Lake, which is really a large pond. People fishing over there. People just enjoying their afternoons after work. So this was Austin's original airport. This was Mueller Airport closed in 1999, turned into a master plan community. So that's pretty unique. Uh, in Austin, most of the master plan communities are gonna be in the outer suburbs. But here, we're only five miles away from downtown, two miles away from the university. We're technically on the east side, but I really wouldn't consider it the east side as it's, its own little subdivision north of what I would call the true East Austin, which is 78702 and 78722. So this is a mixed use master plan community. There's homes, parks, pools, restaurants, uh, grocery stores, shopping, even some, some bars and restaurants, like I said. So there's a ton over here and you really don't have to even leave your community. So like I said, I'm walking along Mueller Pond. You can see there, the birds are just landed in the water. It's, it's really beautiful. There's tons of people walking their dogs and running on the trail along here. Another great thing about Mueller is that they actually dedicated around 20% to public spaces. So that includes parks. Over on the other side of the pool is this, not an auditorium, but this is where they used to have concerts. Uh, and they still do now that, you know, COVID is kind of coming to an end. So I'm walking through Mueller's town center. This is where you're gonna find all the restaurants, the bars, the shopping, the wellness centers. Next to me is Thinkery. This is for kids and families to come and do activities. It's just a large 30,000 square foot activity center. To the left of me, like I said, awesome pub. If you wanna come over, watch some sports, dog spa. And you know, this is all walking friendly. And they've got some more over here under construction. Uh, so there's a ton. And actually behind me, they have an Alamo Draft House, which is basically a movie house and eatery. You can come here, get some food, and have a nice drink while you watch a movie. And then all around here are apartments above. And now most one bedroom apartments around here are about $2,300 a month. That's as of October, 2022. So you're living, essentially it's, Similar to the domain, how you're living above these restaurants and shops, but it's not as crazy as the domain. It's mainly folks living in the community, coming over here to, you know, use the Orange Theory, come see movies, go grab a drink at the pub down this road. Just another great reason to be living over here in Mueller. And then as we go across the street, we're connected back to the park and to the Mueller Lake. So. It's all connected, everything's close and near. So if you're thinking about moving down to Austin, Texas, whether it be at 30 days or 90 days, I cover all things around Austin, Texas, breaking down neighborhoods, subdivisions, and just giving you a feel of what's it like to actually live down here. But I get calls and text messages from people just like you planning to move down here. So don't hesitate to reach down below. I would love to help. But with that being said, Let's jump right into these homes. So behind me is the first home we are coming to. This is actually a town home built in 2017. So over here in Mueller, most of the homes are just a couple years old, or if not, no home is older than 10 or 12 years old. So they're all fairly new. This one is pretty nice, I will say. It's just under 1,900 square feet. I mean, it's just under 2,000 square feet, right around 1,900. It's three bedrooms, two and a half baths, and it's listed for right around a million fifty thousand. So with that being said, Mueller is still a fairly expensive place to live. You know, being so close to downtown, being close, so close to Central Austin and University of Texas, that's why it has this higher price range. So as you can see, as we're walking through the street, most of the homes are closer together, 
lot of townhomes, a lot of condo style homes, but a lot of them have these garden type backyards where most of them have small backyards, but then a shared community yard for you know your dogs to play in. But yeah, but with that being said, let's do a little drive by and get a feel of this part of Mueller. So we're at our second home. This is a fairly new construction again, built in 2018. It's four bedrooms, three baths, just under 2,300 square feet, and just under $1.1 million. It is right across the street from us. See if you can see it. Single family. Now this has a oversized two car garage. Like I said, in this neighborhood, there's not a whole lot of backyard. This home in particular had a patio-like uh, garden type where there's really no grass, but you know at least you have some place to sit outside and enjoy a meal or just enjoy being outside in this beautiful weather. Now, like I said, it's mainly newer homes. There is some still new construction over here, so it's still possible to find some new construction homes in the Mueller neighborhood, though most of the homes are already built. With that being said, let's drive around this part of Mueller and get a feel for the style of homes over here. One other great thing about living in the Mueller community is access to HEB. They have this awesome HEB that is actually paying homage to the design of the Austin Mueller Airport. So pretty sweet and it's right here in Mueller. So you don't even have to leave your community to run to the grocery store real quick. There's also a Torchies over here, a couple other restaurants. So definitely another spot to check out if you are visiting the Mueller area. So I'm over here in the newer side of Mueller. I'm checking out this three bedroom, two and a half bath, new construction behind me. This is just at 1300 square feet. And this is for 625,000. So this is one of their starter homes here. So still again, pricier, but there's plenty of more available as you can see. And frankly, this isn't the only newer style home. They have some newer town homes I see that they're building up the road. And so this is one of their smaller starter homes that they have available. Another thing I wanted to note is that we are super close to the Dell Medical Children's Hospital. Hopefully you'll never have to go there, but just have it safe in mind that you are less than five minutes away. One other thing just to note, yes, the Mueller community is a lot of family oriented but there are a ton of new grads or younger couples living over here as, as well as retired couples living over here. So it's actually a good mix. It's really community oriented. They actually have a farmer's market every weekend. So, you know, you know your neighbor, you know the area and the people that live in your community. And again, it's just a awesome place to live if you're looking for that community sense of living, but again, close to downtown and the rest of Austin. With that being said, this about wraps up today's video. I hope you guys were able to get some information out of it, get you a better sense of what the Mueller community is like and if you guys really wanna live over here. Again, if you guys need help moving at all to Austin, whether you're moving to inner Austin or the outer suburbs, don't hesitate to reach out to me. I love receiving messages from my viewers. And please be sure to subscribe and share this video if you know someone moving to Austin or the Mueller district. We'll catch y'all in the next one.